guys, I'm so tired. If you don't know why I'm tired, watch the previous vlog. Currently we are in Petra and we are in the town of Wadi Musa and we are driving to the Dead Sea. So we have about a three hour drive, I think. So we're gonna hit the road and then maybe grab some food and then we're so excited to show you the Dead Sea. Come on, let's go, let's go. on some back roads, huh? Jordan has the craziest speed bumps ever without warning. Hi guys, and welcome to the Dead Sea. Yes, I'm still in my hiking gear from Petra, but I'm going to take a shower and freshen up. Don't even worry about it. I know you're sitting there like, no, it's not. fine, it's fine. But welcome, we are staying at the Holiday Inn Dead Sea Resort. And we'll just give you a quick room tour because I feel like that's a consistent thing on our channel. Over here, we have a bathroom. The only special thing to point out in this bathroom is that they have purple shampoo. So for all my blonde hair girlies, this is a great hotel for you to stay at. I've never seen a hotel have purple shampoo. And they actually have conditioner, which is a rarity here. Yeah, also conditioner. A lot of hotels don't usually have that. I'm not blonde anymore, so... Actually, comment below, what color is my hair? because I think it's dirty blonde, but Matt says I'm a brunette and I'm not ready to cross into that world yet, if you know what I mean. Yeah, this clip makes your hair look blonde. Okay, and then we come along. Just a standard hotel room, but you know what's not standard? The view. Ready? How many flag with college students does it take to open a door? Only one, thank you, Henry. Welcome to our balcony that I absolutely love. Of course you can see the pool behind me, but you know what you can see over here? The Dead Sea. Stunning. She's stunning. Okay, and this seems like a lively hotel. There's some music and people down by the beach. So for now, we're going to get out of these clothes and enjoy tonight the hotel. You have to do the bed test, otherwise people will be mad. Oh yeah, so I know people get mad when I do, don't do the bed test, but is this controversial because I'm in like my stinky hiking clothes? I'll do it on that side. Uh, Good night. <laughs> Good morning everyone, we're at our free breakfast at the Holiday Inn and we have this little fancy sign saying IHG Rewards Club members. We literally signed up for IHG Rewards the day we booked this hotel. And we get all sorts of special treatment. We have to wear these VIP bracelets and they say that it'll get us special things, but I don't know. But I guess it's just your friendly reminder to sign up for rewards because you get, well, we got an upgrade to a nicer suite. So that was sick. And then anyways, I just wanted to say a day has not gone by in Jordan where I have not had hummus. So I'm thriving, I'm living my best life, and I love Jordan. Hey guys, we are about to go swim at the lowest point on earth. And we're gonna see if it's true that you can really flow as buoyant as people say that you can, or if they're just lying. We're here to tell you the truth on the matter. But first, I wanna show you how I can't float in a pool, and then I'll show you if I can float in the Dead Sea. <laughs> Right guys, so I think that the best way to travel to the Dead Sea is to stay in a hotel because all the hotels have private beach access, which we're walking to now. But I feel like if you stay in an Airbnb, I don't know how you get to the sea. Or we didn't, we didn't research that much, but this hotel's lovely. Getting ready to go into the Dead Sea. It's very hot outside, but I'm not sure what the water temperature is. The water temperature is about 75 degrees and the air temperature is like 94 degrees. So it'll feel a little Fahrenheit. chilly. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the water is like... It looks like jelly. The water like looks like jelly. It's like not clear. You can kind of like see the pattern of the water. Get, get it like in fresh batch. Yeah, there you go. Literally like jelly in that water. So much salt in the water. I heard someone yesterday talking about how this isn't technically a sea because there's no freshwater source. It's more like a lake. And then as it's just becoming smaller and smaller, it's becoming more dense with salt. 
pretty much right <laughs> i guess um but it does have fresh water source the jordan river feeds into here a tiny bit though not mm -hmm. that much okay ready yes whoa <laughs> That's so weird how buoyant it is. Like I can feel it on my legs. It feels like I have a pool noodle on. Yeah, it feels like I have little floaties on. I'm just floating so effortlessly. This is a wild sensation. Try some other tricks. <laughs> Superman. Try to sit down like cross-legged. Oh yeah, wait, you should do this one because you look cooler. Okay. It's so weird, you're like. <laughs> <laughs> It's crazy. This is a crazy feeling. All right, so our lifeguard friend told us that we should stay in the water for 10 minutes and then put the mud all over our whole bodies for 10 minutes and then come wash it off. Mud bath. You guys, look, I'm floating. Are you actually? No. <laughs> Hold on, it's like really uncomfortably cold. Give me a second. Uh. <laughs> I'm a little bit more susceptible to cold water than Patricia, but I am floating now though. Wait, I don't know. Try to balance. Oh. <laughs> oh. It's so weird how far my shoulders are out. Yeah. That's bizarre. It's crazy buoyant. <laughs> God, wait, you gotta taste that. No. Dead sea Stop taste test. Sitting. Dude, that water tastes like, tastes like acid burning on your tongue. Like it okay, tastes like dude. it would dissolve your mouth off. Why would you ever tell me to taste the Dead Sea map? That's so <laughs> taste it. Really bad. No, I did. No, I'm not. For the vlog, for the vlog, you have no, to. Come on. I tasted it. Trust for the vlog. Me. Oh, it's so bad. Why does it taste so bad? Because it's like salt. It's <laughs> dirt. All right, guys, it's time to go put some mud all over our bodies and have a mud bath. That looks disgusting. It's really thick. Okay, ready, mm. Matt? This reminds me of uh, Thailand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Kind of feels good. Mmm, <laughs> yummy. We took our sunglasses off so they don't get all muddy. <laughs> and so we can put it on our faces. What up, guys? <laughs> This looks ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. This is insane. Completely covered in Dead Sea mud. Thanks, Patty. I feel like I'm paying $100 for a nice treatment. Yeah, only 100 but turn it off. It's crazy how like thick and perfect it gets on. It's kind of burning my face a little bit, actually. Quickly. Yeah, I'm all crackly. I kept one hand unmudded so I could safely hold the camera. Do you guys think this is gonna ruin my bathing suit? Guess we'll find out soon. Jesus is crazy, dude. <laughs> all right, guys, we are completely mudded up. We have to wait a few minutes to, for the mud to dry so it can really soak into our skin, and then we're gonna wash it off in the Dead Sea. Guys, my arm looks like elephant skin. Wait, look. Manicure goals. <laughs> no, it does not. You have to like really scrub. Yeah, I really don't know how I'm gonna get this off my face. Uh, what up, guys? <laughs> you taking videos? Of me? <laughs> Gotta get the full Dead Sea experience by washing your face out with it. <laughs> The Dead Sea literally tastes like just eating salt out of a spoon. <laughs> Dead Sea Chopper. My skin is so soft. That actually worked wonderfully. You don't need to go to the spa, just go to the Dead Sea. Hello there. A moment of silence for the last view that we get of the lowest point on earth. 
Right now we are 1,500. You didn't give a moment of silence. Oh. Hell yeah, dude. I love when I'm trying to take a video and they just start mowing in the background. All right guys, so we moved inside because of the lawnmower. We're wrapping up this vlog now and hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog even though it was a bit sporadic, but we are just trying to really enjoy the dead sea and finally getting some beach sun time. This uh, really felt like a vacation and that's kind of a nice break for us and hopefully you guys enjoyed watching us float in the dead sea. And if you made it this far, then you're obviously the coolest person on earth. So definitely make sure to like, subscribe and comment if you want. Okay, give the vloggy a kiss. Are you sad to leave our nice hotel in the Dead Sea? Yeah. We at the Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. Come on, White Balance. Readjust, please. Come on, you got this. All right. Apparently my shirt looks weird. Kind of look like a chef, actually.